solar-powered fan. In the era of solar panels, saving money is possible in almost every aspect, including indoor ventilation. All you need to do is install this fan. It's designed for large spaces, which is evident from its significant size and performance. Whether it's greenhouses or big work areas around your property, this fan is tailored for just that. Saving energy with room ventilation is made possible thanks to a simple solution, solar panels. Yep, it's a fan that runs solely on solar power. You might think there are plenty of these gadgets out there, so what's the big deal? Well, here's the twist. You're not just saving on electricity bills on sunny days, you also don't have to buy an inverter. This fan can hook up directly to your solar power setup. And the savings don't end here. Devices running on solar power usually need regular maintenance, but according to the creators, this fan, because of its simple design, doesn't require that. What about the noise from all those fans? The creators say their invention beats the competition here. Aquahara. If you spot a strange contraption in your neighbor's yard, don't jump to the conclusion that he's a mad scientist. Chances are he's just trying to save on water bills. Yeah, this is really a unique way to save water. It's a system that extracts drinking water from the air, and how it works is quite different from other similar systems. It uses a liquid with a high concentration of a special salt. The ions of this salt attract water molecules from the air. At night, the water is stored in tanks with a salty solution, and during the day, solar panels kick in to distill the water. What comes out is the same drinking water we're used to, but without needing electricity from the grid. This device is a real lifesaver for people living in dry climates with low humidity. When it's a scorching 104 degrees Fahrenheit outside and the air humidity is just 25%, this system produces 53 gallons of water throughout the day. However, making that much water in these conditions requires a hefty investment in 1,080 square feet of solar panels, so it's definitely going to cost you. Sunshine Eco You can save on your electricity bill by using systems like these, which can be installed practically anywhere. These water heating systems are designed without bulky tanks or rigid pipes, unlike other systems. Instead, they're made up of flexible tubes that you can add to however many you need. Plus, they're way easier to move into tight spots. For example, you could spread out these systems all over your roof, on the ground, on a sunshade, and even on walls or fences. The heating principle is exactly the same as with rigid counterparts. Water simply pumped from the pool or any water storage into a tube system. There, it circulates and gradually heats up before returning. It's as efficient, simpler, and even adds a touch of aesthetics. So why not save some money this way? Solar Blinds Regular blinds already help save electricity by blocking sunlight and preventing rooms from heating up. However, the startup Solar Gaps decided that wasn't just enough. Their blinds are equipped with an array of monocrystalline solar panels, which not only protect the room from the sun, but also harness its energy to generate power. According to the creators, this solar setup can yield up to 100 watt hours of energy per 10 square feet when installed outside a window, or up to 50 watt hours when placed indoors. And rest assured, these blinds are efficient. They have a light sensor that automatically adjusts the angle of the slats to better absorb the sunlight. Of course, the creators didn't forget about the usual blinds functions. You can open and close them using a smartphone app. And you can even set up a schedule for that. Plus, there's a motion sensor so they can open when someone enters the room. You can keep an eye on your blind's performance and enjoy the cost savings with the app. Just be aware you'll need to invest a bit up front. The standard solar blinds unit comes in at $783. Solar Greenhouses Isn't this a unique greenhouse? It's not just for growing food, it can also add a charming touch to your backyard. But the greenhouse you see on screen is good for more than just that. You might spot something interesting on the greenhouse roof. These are solar panels catching sunlight to power all the equipment needed for growing plants or to send electricity back to the house. Either way, it's a savvy way to cut costs. Wondering why these greenhouses are painted in such a unique color? It's because of a special purple fluorescent pigment that transforms green light into red. 
Studies have found that this pigment is highly efficient for plant growth. By setting up a greenhouse like this on your property, you can not only reduce your electricity bills, but also enjoy faster growing crops that are less prone to diseases. Plus, they'll need a bit less water and yield more produce, leading to extra savings. Beltecno Water Tanks if you need to set up tanks for storing liquids on your property, check out these reservoirs with a unique look. Their distinct appearance comes from the material they're made of, stainless steel. Thanks to this material, Bell Techno tanks have advantages over the competitors. First off, setting up these storage tanks is pretty straightforward since they don't weigh a lot. This also means installation costs less, saving you money. Plus, these tanks don't react with the liquids inside, they last longer, and there's less chance of leaks. On top of that, stainless steel doesn't corrode. In other aspects, these tanks are similar to the others out there. They come in various sizes, from small ones to those big enough to hold a strategic reserve of liquid. Plus, they're great at retaining heat because of the insulation, meaning you can store warm water in them for a long time, reducing the need for electricity to heat it up. Power Free you can easily turn your balcony into an area that helps make your home more energy efficient. You just need to install a system from Big Blue. It features solar panels boasting 200 watts of power each. They're designed to be used on balconies. Simply hang them on the outer side of your balcony railing and fasten them securely. Once the panels are set up on the balcony, it's time to focus on other components. Those are a battery with a capacity of 2560 watt hours and a smart controller that connects it to the solar panels. On sunny days, when the solar panels generate excess energy, it gets stored in the battery. Later, during nighttime or on cloudy days without sunlight, you can use this stored energy without relying on the main power grid. Thanks to the controller, you can adjust the operation modes of the panels and the battery using a smartphone app. It's important to mention that the system is suitable for balconies, not just because of the way it's installed. Every part can handle temperatures from minus 4 degrees Fahrenheit to plus 113 degrees Fahrenheit and is resistant to moisture. Solar Canopy Here's a canopy that serves a few purposes, keeping you shaded from the blazing sun and sheltered from rain, while also helping you save on electricity. This is made possible by a simple solution, replacing the canopy roof with solar panels. These panels are designed for outdoor use, so they're protected from rain and even hail, plus the canopy itself is made of aluminum, capable of withstanding winds up to 200 miles per hour. The effectiveness of a solar canopy can differ based on how much of your roof is covered with solar panels. If you're only looking to charge your devices, smaller canopies will suffice. However, if you need to generate energy for your home, you might want to consider larger canopies. These canopies do more than one job at a time, and they're pretty flexible in terms of where you can put them. If your house has a flat roof, now you can relax outdoors without worrying about the sun or rain. Even if you have a narrow space next to your house, you can still install a canopy there. One downside of such canopies is that many owners in the face of a natural disaster would prioritize saving their solar panels rather than themselves from harm. By the way, this kind of canopies also can serve another purpose, making money. You can set up one of these solar canopies near a road for charging electric cars and run an ad campaign. The profit won't be huge, but the canopy will pay for itself much quicker in the end. M Technic Solar Roof What's the point of having standalone solar panels when there are M Technic solar roofs that outshine them in practically every way? To start off, let's talk about appearance. Have you ever seen a roof where solar panels don't seem like an out of place addition? If you have, it's probably only in designer projects. But here we have a chic and modern roof without a single element that feels out of place. Apart from that, while solar panels are designed to be durable, they stand out as separate pieces on the roof. 
This means that strong winds or physical damage could cause them to detach and get damaged. However, with m Technic Solar Roof, the photovoltaic elements are directly integrated into the roofing structure, replacing traditional shingles, which makes them much more resilient. The only area where solar panels have an upper hand is their efficiency. Yet, by outfitting your entire roof with m Technic elements, you'll have more than enough energy to fuel the majority of devices in your home. Fornitec Green Roof Making your roof green, perhaps with the assistance of companies like Fornitec, could be one of the most inventive ways to enhance your home's energy efficiency. The company uses its own lightweight sandwich panel for roof improvement made from natural materials. It meets all the requirements for green roof vegetation, including nutrients, hummus, water, and more. Also, installing greenery on the roof is much easier because the panels don't use any bulky materials. First, you lay down the base, and then you simply place the green panel on it. There you go, the roof is now partially green and by continuing the installation, you can completely transform the flat roof of a house or any other structure in a relatively short amount of time. There are plenty of advantages to having a green roof. In the summer, it keeps your house cooler by blocking some of the heat, and in the winter, it helps hold in warmth. On top of that, it works as a noise buffer and catches small dust particles. All of these perks add up to a significant energy and cost savings. People living in rainy areas know another great benefit of green roofs. Having plants on your roof can actually prevent your house from flooding when it rains a lot. This is because the plants soak up about 82% of the rainwater, which is way more than the 27% absorbed by a regular gravel roof. Vesta If you've got $234,000 and a strong desire to cut costs, consider getting Sarah's company to build this energy-efficient house. The first thing that catches the eye is the greenhouse extension. It sits on the ground floor of the house and measures 10 by 39 feet. It might not be huge, but it's perfect for providing some of your own food and cutting down on grocery bills for a small family. Plus, it's designed to save on electricity. With a roof made of see-through polycarbonate, it doesn't need extra lighting, and heating can be managed from the house without extra equipment. Having a built-in greenhouse is quite intriguing and incredible useful, but let's not forget about the house itself. It's designed using the popular passive solar technology that's making waves in today's world. The house's unique design will help it stay cool during the summer months, while its high-quality insulation with 4-inch panels for walls and 6-inch panels for the roof will trap warmth from the sun in the colder seasons. Although you'll still need electricity, the creators claim the savings are expected to be substantial. And you know what? It's totally believable. How much do you reckon Aussies living in these passive solar homes save? Their electricity bills are slashed by a whopping 90%. Grief Vertical Wind Turbine Let's not forget about the wind, which will play a significant role in cutting down on electricity costs thanks to these turbines. Turbines from Grief have a unique design compared to traditional solutions. Their rotor shaft is positioned vertically, and the main components are located at the base of the structure. These are vertical axis blades. These wind turbines, unlike their counterparts, are quieter, lighter, and sturdier. Plus, the turbine can spin and harness wind energy from any direction. When it comes to the amount of energy generated, it depends on the type of turbine. There are small wind turbines with a power output of 500 watts, which can be installed in almost any location around the house. However, there are also larger options with a much higher power output of 5 kilowatts. These larger turbines can't just be tucked away in a corner, they require quite a bit of space. Despite differences in power and size, grief turbines are equally resilient to weather conditions. They smoothly operate in temperatures ranging from minus 40 to plus 122 degrees Fahrenheit, withstand stormy winds, and even endure some physical damage. Pico Pica what are some other ways to generate energy and save on overall electricity costs? If there's a river nearby, the solution might just be right in front of you. 
These turbines function in a simple and commonly known way. As water moves, it rotates a shaft, and the rotational energy is transmitted to a generator, which turns it into electricity. You're looking at a turbine that not only looks small, but also generates very little electricity. It has a power output of just 10 watts, which probably won't be enough for anything other than charging a phone. But here's the thing. It weighs only 38 pounds, so one person can easily install it. Right now, you're looking at a much more powerful option. It's rated at 500 watts, but setting it up is quite tricky because it weighs 550 pounds. Regardless of which turbine you install, you can generate electricity around the clock, even on cloudy or windless days. Your bills will keep dropping consistently day in and day out as long as there's a steady flow of water.